During Nelly's performance, his eyes rolled to the back of his head. Watch this. I also noticed something else interesting. So I'm going to replay the video in slow motion. Pay close attention. He throws up what? The devil horns and 666, which means the mark of the beast. Throwing up demonic signs, eyes rolling in the back of his head. Y'all, come on. And looking at this picture, man, you don't have to be a Christian to recognize something unclean is manifesting. Some people said this happened because Nelly was high and drunk. I would say that can be partially true, but let me take it further. Alcohol and drugs are gateways for unclean spirits to possess people's bodies. However, no matter what the case may be, it's obvious that something unclean is manifesting on this picture. If you're a fan of Nelly, let me ask you a question. Are you a devil worshiper or a Satanist? Because y'all favorite artist loves throwing up satanic imagery to y'all. Now, if you confess to worship the devil, I understand why you support people who promote demons. But if you said no, please make it make sense to me why you support people that throws up devil horns, 666, and eyes roll in the back of their head while they are performing. Look at this picture, condescending, dark, sinister, no graphics, no designers, no makeup. This is reality. It's not art or entertainment. However, it's clear as day that something unclean is manifesting. Because they tapped into the demonic. They don't throw up demonic signs for nothing. Why y'all think gang members throw up gang signs? They do it to communicate. And when artists are throwing up devil horns, 666, and other occultic symbols, it's to communicate to the world. They are saying, this is whose side I'm on. Whether you believe it or not. It's all a part of the agenda. If you support this, goodness, something wrong. If somebody knocked on your door looking like this, would you open your door? Would you treat them as normal? I'm sure you wouldn't. But on the other hand, y'all give celebrities a free pass to release poison in y'all life. See, I don't care if they're a celebrity or well-known. Whatever manifesting in their lives proves what they tapping into. And I don't mind calling an ace a ace a spade a spade because I'm responsible for what enters my soul. And I refuse to let these celebrities deceive me and intoxicate me with their poisonous images. They can have their money. They can have this image here and they can have their fame. But for me and my house, we're going to serve the Lord. And we're not coming out like this. God bless you.